Hello everyone, welcome back to this wonderful video, part 2 on how to create a transparent drop down navigation menu with CSS and HTML. So, as you saw, we stopped on this and we have not yet done anything but these blade points are not showing. So, we have to remove this color because I had used it when I had put the photo so let's first bring them back this is how our menu looks like so in inside the channel we are having these sub unordered lists with items and also under service contacts and location it's only home without any drop down list so let us style them we shall first select the unordered list oh. open carry brackets we shall give them margin margin of zero pixels and also padding of zero pixels and list list style type we should be none and this is what will happen we have given them we have removed the margin and padding and we also remove those bullets you are seeing so Next, we target the unordered list, then the LI, the list items. So, this is how we are moving. We first, we first target the unordered list. Now we are targeting the list items. Then, we shall float them to left. Float them. To left so far so good so we flow them to the left and when we save that and check in our browser this is how it will be looking so far so good we shall give it a width of 200 pixels width of 200 pixels so save that let's check this is how it is right now every menu now is having its content i'll give it height height of 40 pixels and check out this is how it will be looking we give it background color of black background color it should be black background color black this is how it's looking so next we shall give it line height line height of 40 pixels again 40 pixels check it out that's how it is right now we shall also add it text align alignment it will be centered center preview it whoa cool we are progressing we shall give it a font size of 20 pixels it's a font size which is 20 pixels reload yes now it's somehow seen so we shall give it now the opacity 
and this is what will make our menu navigation menu transparent point zero save by right now I, I don't think it looks cool there I'm first going to remove it so what I'm going to do let us add our image there which is here background image uniform resource locator the URL then you put the image save so this background size cover it will make it occupy the full browser so this is how our menu is being represented so to make it transparent you just have to add opacity opacity 0.8 semicolon so when we will re refresh you should be able to see the background next let us target the anchor tags url l a so open curry brackets so since we are targeting the links we have to remove the underlines and there we shall say text decoration to none and when i save as you can see our lines are gone i also give it a color of white color white and also display block as you can see we have given it color white and displayed block next let us introduce this hover state so the hover state will be url lia full colon over and we say background color background background color we shall give it green green or oh, cool this is how it looks like you can also put any color like yellow yellow but yellow isn't cool so we shall leave green to so we don't need this to be here we need it to create like a drop down list what we have to do we hide it by putting URL LI URL LI and we shall say display display to none and when we save control S and come back to our code it will be seen as you can see our lists are hidden and even if we click this it will take us nowhere or bring them what we have to do now we call them back and calling them back is the easiest l i u l l i we say hover when a user hovers over the menu button please call u l li and we tell it to display block so guys when you reload you should be able to show us the list items As you can see we have created a beautiful transparent 
navigation menu system so you can go and play around with the code if you need the code please do email me go to the about page you see my email there please send me the text so let us try to add some effect like as you can see it's so fast when you are hovering over our text so to put some transition effect come here put transition whoa transition two seconds and shall be targeting the background color is zero second so check out this see the effect comes in a slow motion way when you're hovering over the certain text you get that beautiful move or motion some things in a slow motion mode so guys thanks for watching please subscribe on my channel as i told you we are having a variety of images here so even if i want to change the image i just go here since they all have the same name but different numbers i put one save this wallpaper one when I change that, still it gives me the same effect. So how cool is this? Still I'm having another image. Wallpaper 2. I just go here. Change to 2. Save it. Refresh. Oh, this one may not work it has refused let's try wallpaper 4 wallpaper 4 save so this one has worked whoa and it looks so cool we have in that green hoover state and also the vegetation it brings out some cool effect as you can see you can still see something which is behind the green vegetation so still we are having a lot of images wallpaper 5 I just put here 5 click save having our railway still you can see everything the way it is in the background and lastly i'm having this wallpaper 6 let's try to see if it will show wallpaper 6 save come back to the browser refresh whoa it's also displaying very well so that's it guys thanks for watching please subscribe on my channel share the videos on different social medias and be blessed i'm out Bye -bye.